season number four, right? Or season three? Season four? Four? Because we count one for each semester. So I think this is four. Four uh, sounds about right. Yeah. Vendetta intern sure. draft. So we're going to do things a little bit differently this time around. The college kids, they start at different times. One of them starts on Monday. Some of them start like the 23rd, which is like two, three weeks away. So uh, we're going to have a supplemental draft for the kids that don't have their videos turned in. But I feel like maybe the golden stars of the class might have already turned their videos in. So we have some of the vets here. Hopefully they can mentor the good ones. Uh, we'll see if anyone good hasn't turned in their video yet. But we have a couple submissions. First, we'll go over the last semester, and then we'll get to these kids. So Garrett's here. Bagdonis is here. Jackson Law's here. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Uh, we got to announce a winner first. So let's go over each person's pick from last semester, catch people up, see what the intern accomplished while they were here, and then we'll go from there. So first pick overall last year or last semester. Garrett, you had Dom. Did he fit your expectations? Did he fit in well? How would you say he did during his time? Um, I don't believe that he lived up to number one pick expectations. Um, okay. I, think, I think he started off well, though. Uh, he started off pretty good. Uh, Post production wasn't so bad. While the articles may not have been great, he was still getting them out there. He was taking feedback, stuff like that. Halfway through, it kind of just all fell apart. There was a lack of communication. There was a project that we had talked about at the beginning of the semester that he said he was going to do. I asked him for a check in on it. He didn't reach out to me. He reached out to you about it instead. I guess maybe he said he didn't want to do it or something. So we nixed the idea all together and then haven't heard from him since. So. Oh, never, tough. never, never really lived up to expectations. So. Well, he's still here and he, he, uh, I think he did two blogs the other day, right? And his, te his technical, his technical internship starts in January. So he got a head start on things. Apparently he wasn't eligible to do his real internship. So now his real internship will start, but he's not part of the show anymore. He's well, just a normal staff person. Well, let's hope he uses this as a learning experience. Okay. Doesn't seem like it was the most positive experience for you then, Garrett. Well, I think I might have been a little... I might have had too high expectations because last year, I had the last semester, I had James Eric, who is a superstar. So maybe, maybe I was pushing some of the expectations on the Dom, but at the same time, I think that there was there was more room for potential there. But I mean, it's it's early. Maybe he'll, maybe he'll turn it around. Who knows? Fair enough. So the number two overall pick, uh, that was James Herrick. He took Chase Rocker Bomber. Uh, James is not here to defend his pick, but, uh, I think it's pretty safe to say that when we do the supplemental draft, he'll be picking at the end. Bag donuts. You're smiling. You got some comments. No, I think, I no think comments. all, all that dirty laundry has been aired out. If you ask me, you know what I mean? Jackson, any comments? No, I wasn't involved in the last one, so. Gary, you got to give me some fireworks here. Give me something. Well, I mean, what what more is there to say? I think that I think he he's already been buried. He he's buried and he's done for. We we shipped him off to sea. There's no there's no sense in bringing him back up. Yeah. Uh, third overall pick was Jack Abrams by Jerry Walker. Jack, he's kind of uh, he tried to learn the stream yard. He does Facebook postings once in a while. I wouldn't say he made the biggest impact, but he passed. So there's that. And he's still here. Uh, we'll see if he ever starts writing. I was told that's the next thing he's supposed to transition into. So still waiting on some articles out of Jack, but he survived. And that's more than Chase can say. So, Well, he's got a hell of a, a, hell of a mentor, too, in Jerry Walker. So if, yeah. if, there, if there's someone at the site to turn the guy into a writer, it's Jerry Walker. So... Yeah. Then after that, they were all names out of hats. <laughs> Dylan O'Brien, I think uh, positive reviews on him. Max has continued to do a good job with the WWE section. They got that Burning Hammer show. I uh, I wish Dylan O'Brien would post like Mark Izzo, but, you know, work in progress. I think he at least did his part. Yeah. He was cooking, so. Who else am I missing? Uh, Taylor Kennedy. Seatbelt girl did not survive. She ghosted. 
she created zero projects. So we never really heard from her after the intern draft. What about uh what about Saban? Yeah, Bagdonis, yeah. you want to give you want to give some thoughts? Well, I'll preface I I don't get along with many Eagles fans, but Jack Saban is a superstar. I I superstar. I I'm a big fan of his. He's he's, he's throwing bad. around the word superstar. I think he writes some really good articles. He he gets on the YouTube with some videos every now and again and you know, from the very beginning we were talking about article ideas and I told him you should write a Trevion Diggs is overrated post and you know that that was kind of the start from it and I think he's doing a really good job so far. So are you, are you saying that Jack Saban should win Bagdonis? Look, I mean it's he's my pick, so obviously I want him to win, but <laughs> that's all I can say. I you know, I'm not going to I can't have my uh, my hand in too many hats, you know. Jackson, as someone that didn't get to pick an intern last semester, it seems to be a two-horse race between Dom and Jack Saban. Would you like to declare a winner? I mean, I feel like it, I, I I don't know because I feel like what Saban writes more about is stuff that I read. So Ooh. it's like I see I see a lot of Saban stuff more. And he did come in clutch the other day. Um, so far to start the start the Uh-oh. new year, he was he was one of those one of those guys that was a uh, um, a lot of news was just rapid firing to start the year. And uh, Saban was the dude that's like, guys, got this. You step up. So interesting fact, I just want to pull this up. Dom actually has him beat in the post race. Did anyone have that guess? It is 97 to 75. So Dom did outpost him. But I think it's more so Jack's been catching him rather than. Uh, I feel like he's on a bit of a hot streak. Yeah, Every hot time streak. I check the social media slack, I'm always seeing, you know, Jack Saban writes this and. You know, I go on the YouTube, I see a video from him, and, you know, we, he's very good in different uh, areas. You know, I see some NFL stuff. I see some, you know, all over. That's, that's you know, I'm not going to I'm not going to contaminate, you know, but. And that's not me guy. discrediting what, what Dom does or anything like that. I think they're both excellent, and I think that. Excellent. I, said. I think, hey, is this the type of year where we have, like, a co-rookie of the years? Like, uh, uh, what year did the NBA do that? I forget what year it was. Was it? It was like yeah, was it Grant Hill or and then someone else. I think I can't remember, but there was one year where there were two rookies that came into the NBA, and they were both so good that they were just like, ah, give it to them both. Garrett, how do you feel about co-winners? If if Bagdonis is cool with co-winners, I'm cool with co-winners. I'm I'm cool with co-winners too. You knew he was gonna fold. You knew <laughs> that was gonna fold. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You know what? I'm fine with co-winners. They go to the same school. Same there you go. There you have it. What, what school do they go to? They're both Nevada people. Ah, Nevada. Putting them out. Yeah. All right. We'll do co-winners. That's fine with me. I don't know if they both deserve shirts, though. I guess send two shirts then. Well, it's like a similar address, I guess. So I'm probably won't. you just send it to Nevada. Have to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Uh, congratulations, Jack and Dom. I guess they're the winners. Great job, guys. Yeah, we'll figure we'll figure out what we're gonna do there. So Look that up real quick. This is gonna be the uh, the first draft. There's gonna be a second supplemental draft for the people that haven't turned their videos in. Again, a lot of them start on different days. So hopefully, we'll get the ones that have been paying attention before the start date. We'll have them get picked and then we'll have another draft. So, or maybe we'll even leave it. Hey, if you want to trade after you pick somebody, you can or something. I don't know. We'll see uh, how it goes. Real quickly. It was, it was Grant Hill and Jason Kidd, 94, 95. Okay. NBA. Cole, there you go. Cole it's NBA, back. So. It's back. There we go. All right. So, can we play the videos? Let's get more. Let's get them rolling. Yep. Hi everyone. My name is Audrey. I am the social media intern. I currently am going to UNR, which is located in Reno, Nevada. We're having a huge storm roll through right now, so that's a fun time. Um, my major is in journalism, and my emphasis is in public relations and my minor is in communications. Um, I really like what I do, and I'm super excited to work with all of you. Um, I think that we're all... 
What happened to the video? Uh oh. That was it. That was it. Yeah, she okay. only had a, like a thirty second video. Jackson Law, what do you think? Uh, Audrey is going to be tasked with handling the social media department, a, a department that I see as failing. So we'll see if Audrey can change that. Yeah, I mean, I guess it's just like, is it just strictly like doing posts or like getting posts out? Or is it also um, like other things like highlights and stuff? She's like being that. handed the keys. Oh, just the keys to the kingdom, the whole thing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, uh, that's definitely a tall task, and a lot of people have tried. A lot of people have failed. Let's they've see all if failed. she can step up. I think they've all failed. Probably, yeah. Kyle Barron's included. Rip. Next one. Hi, my name is Graham Prater. I'm a senior at the University of Nevada, Reno. I live in Nevada, but in Las Vegas, not Reno, but you know. I'm doing a sports content contributor position here at Vendetta for an internship. I like to golf, watch hockey, and play video games. The latter being my primary reason for joining up with Vendetta. I'd like to work on the, the uh, esports section if possible. I'm excited to be working with you all, and I hope to have a wonderful experience here. Okay, so I'm just going to hand Max Everett Graham. He is going to be uh, a gaming writer here. So I feel like Max being his mentor only makes sense. So he is not up for pick. There you so have I, it. I think that seems fair. All right. All right. Easy. All right. Last two. Then, or last Hi, guys. Two. I'm Griffin Crest. I'm a sports content contributor, writer, and I'm an intern, obviously. I go to Indiana University, and I play club golf there. And... And I'm just excited to meet everyone and being able to work with everyone. Bagdonis, he looks like your long lost cousin. Are you considering? I know. I, I was thinking he's a golf guy. I, I know a thing or two about golf and he seems pretty cool. Um, you know, I know we've had some Indiana people rolled through here in the past. And Do you think he kind of looks like you? Oh, I, I see the I see the features. I do see some similarities. I can't, you know, you, you caught that, Trey. I can't lie. <laughs> okay. All right, last one. What's going on? Why are these videos so horribly quality? I'm an intern. That shit up. I'm from New York before I moved to Florida, and I go to school at Arizona State University, the Cronkite School. I'm a multimedia journalist. I do podcasting, and I do uh, sports writing, um, and also I have my own business, so I'm a pretty busy guy, but I love writing about sports and talking about sports. Uh, I'm a Giants and a Mets fan, and uh, I'm excited to get started. Why are those videos so horrible quality? I missed, they look I missed good his, on Slack. You gotta play that again. I missed his name. What was his yeah. name? Play the play it again. I'm on it. I'm on it. I'm on it. <clears throat> What's going on, everybody? My name is Julian Casciano. I'm an intern. I'm from originally from New York before I moved to Florida and I go to school at Arizona State University, the Cronkite School. I'm a multimedia journalist. I do podcasting and I do uh, sports writing um, and also have my own business. So I'm a pretty busy guy, but I love writing about sports and talking about sports. Uh, I'm a Giants and a Mets fan and uh, I'm excited to get started. Garrett, Julian seems like a busy guy. Do you want to invest your time in a busy guy? No. <laughs> oh. I, I, I mean, this is no disrespect to the kid, obviously. But, like, if you're going to school already and you already own a business, how are you supposed to have time to pump out articles and get better? Like, if, yeah. if he's got the work ethic to do it, more power to him. But I don't – I don't – I am I have my concerns. Okay. Fair enough. So, I guess as co-winners, Garrett keeps his first overall selection – since uh, he hasn't failed yet at mentoring someone. <laughs> That's a plus, I guess. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Herrick gets to move to the back, so, you know. Well, yeah. Garrett, first pick. Who you got? Who you want? You got three it, options. Or you can say, hey, you know, maybe I want to wait. Maybe I'm, I want to 
maybe I want to ponder my options. With with no disrespect to the group of people we just watched their videos, I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off my pick until we get the rest of the videos. Fair, you can absolutely no problem. Bag donuts. I think I'm doing the same thing. You're not picking anybody either. I'm. <laughs> um, I mean, well, there's this whole crop in the no. Again, no disrespect to them. They all seem like very nice people, and I I wish them all the best. But there, okay. I there was one video that was like nine seconds long. I don't know anything about the kid. <laughs> like, how am I supposed to gauge if I want to draft you or not as my intern? If you send a nine second video saying, "Hey, it's <laughs> golf. I go to Indiana. No. Sub." <laughs> like, what am I supposed to do with that? Jackson, I can't do anything with it. You got the first pick. <laughs> <laughs> would you like to select or would you like to hold off until you see all the videos? Guys, I think this video might have been a waste of time. Because, uh... <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't a waste of time because we went over the winners. We had to do that anyway. That's true. That's true. That's true. We got co-winners out of the way, at least. We got co-winners out of the way. I guess yeah. that, that was my contributing... Uh, my one contribution to this video. So nobody's picking. I got to, I got to see the field. Like I'm probably going to end up having a lower pick because I wasn't in the, uh, because I wasn't in the last one. So I don't, I don't know, man. I got to, I got to see, I got to, I just, I got to see, I got to weigh like the options. I like, I love the enthusiasm that, uh, what was her uh, name? Was it uh, Audrey? Yeah. Like I like the enthusiasm that she had. Uh uh julian same concerns like you know if uh you know is he gonna have time to do all this you know if he does fantastic i'm never rooting for anyone to come through here to fail and then yeah uh, i missed his name but i just got him down as bagdonis's lost cousin yeah exactly Uh, if i pick him then everyone's the conspiracy theories are going to be coming out or something (laughs) like how do i know that's just not yeah but did you see with an indiana michael buffer they never knew each other and he just sent in a uh Send in a video like I, Bruce I Buffer and Michael Buffer, they're brothers and they, they didn't grow up with each other. They found each other through broadcast. There you go. So maybe. Wow. This could be your long lost sibling. Yeah. Yeah. How does it feel? I mean, I, I, I it's like everyone has said, I just need to see the field a little better before I make a decision. On, on so we got to see their pro days. Got to see the pro day. Exactly. Yeah. We need to set up some combine, you know, it's too early to see turn the card 40 in. Time. Way too early yeah, to turn exactly. the card in. See what the vertical is, you know, <laughs> What a turn of events. What a turn of events. I think I think uh all of them in turn have to run a 40. Did you see Griffin in the random chat? He just said Bagdonis and I are not brothers. <laughs> 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 all right, I think we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to wait. Whenever you're gonna Griffin is his that. name. Okay, okay. We're gonna have to record. Okay. I apologize, Griffin. I missed the name. No, I, I apologize too, Griffin. I mean absolutely no disrespect or anything. What? No, this is this is not disrespectful in no any way. This is just here. this is just we're having fun. We're having fun. The whole point of it is having fun. All right. I guess I guess this is episode one, and then we're going to have to make episode two, and all the names are still available. So, okay. Right. Thanks for everything. Yep. Peace out, Girl Scout.